goddamn clothes back on. <laughs> Let me just holding that one. Fredo had an easier time with the gun than you did with the recorder. Oh man! Nice! Holy jeez, perfect! <laughs> so that's far away. You can act like a man! Right. What's what the matter with you? You know what would have been perfect after that? You should have yelled, Papa! Papa! So, that's from very far away. Here's closer to the stage. Put your goddamn clothes back on. <laughs> 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 <Poor guy. laughs> and finally, from the pocket of the guy who said it. Okay. It's on the bed. Hold on. Kathleen, put your goddamn clothes back on. Hup, 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 hup. <laughs> Oh, I'm all hot. I'm, I'm all like hot yeah. listening to this. I can't listen. Does your head itch? Yeah, yeah. It's like feeling, yeah. all prickly. Yeah. Ugh. I want to run away. Yeah. <laughs> all right, it gets better. So uh, this person. No, I got it. I got it. I got it. Right. <laughs> so this person uh, does it <laughs> and sits back down and just, you know, he's going to try to enjoy the rest of the uh, the show. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, uh, <laughs> a little bouncer. A little Broadway bouncer came uh, up to him. Well, yeah, yeah. The the, the, the usher. The, did he dance up? Six. <laughs> he looks like a football player, dude. <laughs> you're gonna have to leave. You're gonna have to leave. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime gal. Get your ass out of the seat. Now, obviously, what you don't see by by listening to this tape is uh, this person. You are Renee Hole tonight. <laughs> <laughs> this person having a uh, a major confrontation with the usher, right? And then he's trying to talk to the people around him. When you're a dick, you're a dick all the way. <laughs> yeah. So he's uh, he's just making a scene around him. Yeah. Trying to uh, show all the people around him how pissed off he is that he didn't know that uh, Kathleen was going to be naked in this play. Oh, he's not giving up yet. So listen to this. You'll hear a lot of whispering, but it's uh, it's uh, this guy and uh, the usher. Right, the usher who's like 6'3", 250, huge guy. <laughs> this is obviously right after you <laughs> Right. Within, I don't know, 30 seconds tops. This place is terrible. That's him, like, talking to a person he doesn't know right next to him. <laughs> <laughs> and the person is like, shut up, I don't want to be a social They're shocked, idea. yeah. Right. I think that's well, Ridiculous. What? It's offensive. No, I'm not going to get up. No. I think this is offensive. Now he goes, get out of the theater and I'll give you a refund. Get out of the theater. You think it's offensive? Get out of the theater and I'll give you a refund. It's necessary for to take her clothes off. I'm offended. <laughs> Come this way, please. Come this way. Do you hear that? What did he That's just really say? really hard to hear, but he's saying, if I have to, I will physically remove you. He says, if I have to remove you physically, I will. If I have to remove you physically, I will. He's got to whisper because, right. you know, there's been enough disruption in the program already. <laughs> and how do you not get a rod with a man saying that to you? <laughs> I double dare you, sir. Double dog dare you. <laughs> Listen closely. I don't. It's really hard to hear, but you might pick it up. You can't take me out physically. On what basis? Why does she have to be naked? <laughs> Alright, let's go. I want a refund. This is ridiculous. <laughs> I want a refund. The ticket was given to the son of a bitch. And he's, he wants a refund. Dude, this whole thing has a great ending, trust me. I want get, a refund. Did you hear the whole thing? He's like, well, if you're offended, then get up and I'll give you a get refund. And I'll refund your ticket. But I can't believe she's naked. That's not the point. That's not the point. <laughs> that bouncer's never had to say anything to anyone in there. No. Except maybe to turn off your cell phone. <laughs> All right. 
So now he decides, all right, I'm going to go get a refund. That's right. I need to leave. So now you got to picture this. He's leaving the row, and he's pretty much uh, talking to everyone on the way out of the row. Yeah, on yeah. the way out now, he's talking to the people that are sitting on the aisle who are just horrified and not making an ounce of eye contact with the <laughs> madman. They don't want to acknowledge this guy again. Yeah. It's like when you see a kid come out of the confessional, you just don't want to know. You just look straight ahead, <laughs> no questions. I know you're crying. You must have felt guilty. <laughs> it was your fault. <laughs> All right, let's duck walk you back to the car. <laughs> 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 All right, here he goes as he leaves his row. This person has got to come forward so we can talk to him about all this. This way? Ridiculous. There's no reason for her to be naked. I can't believe you people watch this. This is ridiculous. It's offensive. It's unnecessary for her to be naked. I get a picture. He's not talking to himself. He's talking to people around him. No one is acknowledging that. No, no. that he's talking to them. Very, very angry. <laughs> so it is ridiculous nonsense. Now I'm assuming uh, you're outside the actual theater in the ticket area? Uh, this particular person, yeah. Now he's out where you get the tickets, out by the street area. Right, and uh, he's getting his refund. Right, listen to that. For the ticket that was given right, to right. him. And listen to how his balls expand. Listen to that. He gets even ballsier. Right, listen, <laughs> listen to this. You hear that, right? Yeah, give him his money. Could you refund uh, this gentleman his money? Plus the ticket master service charge. <laughs> Oh my God! The massive set of balls. <laughs> he gets the refund. He wants the ticket master search charge. <laughs> I gotta hear that again. Bravissimo! One of the best performances on Broadway. That is Tony Award winning. Plus the ticket master service charge. We can only give you the refund of the ticket. Right. All right, fine. Ridiculous. You know, don't you think there should be some disclaimer about the nudity? I mean, that's ridiculous. It's unnecessary. So people should be ashamed of themselves. No, you have a nice Thank you. There you go. Out on the screen. The Ticketmaster surcharge. <laughs> and he played that so perfectly. Because yeah. if you were laughing and goofing, they would have been really... But they're like, all right, we get a religious nut. Like, yeah, right. He's get a freak. Out, right, exactly. And he won't come back. And he, what did you arrest him? They thought he was Brent. <laughs> I happen to have young children. Well, that went so well. well that I wouldn't be surprised. One more if clip. We see something like this happen again. One more clip. Yeah, yeah. He's walking down the street and he's still uh, taking parting shots. Nobody turned around. Nobody said a goddamn thing. In wimps. <laughs> Theater goers are fags. <laughs> no, one, no, one said anything. no one said anything to him. They got a couple of gasps or something, but there wasn't the uh, the real uh, anger from the crowd. Like, why don't you sit down and shut up? And That's amazing. You got someone the first gas for it, and boom, it happened. That's it. I can only imagine. Like, I'm thinking of the shows on Broadway and some of the people that are... Uh, on Broadway right now, and some of the lines that could just be shouted out, and I'm dying here. Incidentally, oh. couldn't uh, old Jim Norton's pals O and A have said interrupt this Cleveland show by running up and giving him a Hummer? That would have been a nice thing to do. <laughs> you had a good enough time. <laughs> oh, those guys. I think this starts a new bit on the show, though. Eh? Yeah, the whole Broadway thing, and maybe we'll expand it uh, to pretty much uh, do show us your balls. Show us your balls. Show us your balls. Yeah. That can mean just about anything, right, Ann? It's pretty ballsy, what you just heard there. Show us your balls. She's gonna and sue. bring us the tape. Yep. Isn't that amazing? That, that's the best they can do, is you're going to sue? Uh. I'll sue. <laughs> I was very embarrassed 
<laughs> sitting there, and a gentleman was uh, yelling at Kathleen to put her goddamn clothes on. I, uh, I fell off of my chair. My glasses broke, and my shoes fell off. Should I bring my glasses and my liposuction? I was horrified. Mike. Yo. Hey, Mike. What's, up, What's man? happening? What's up? Uh, listen, I was watching the uh, NBC News earlier about lunchtime, yeah. and they were showing, you know, how she was in doing that, you know, the stage thing and everything, and they said, St watch tonight uh, for shocking shouts from the audience, you know. I, I put two and two together, and this is what I'm coming up with. How big a boy are you down there, sir? What's that? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mike, thank you. Uh, Norton sucks my mule. Right. Oh, <laughs> there you go. True. Yeah, right. Norton you know, comment. Make a promise and hang up, you. <laughs>